This is your Eagle Update for June 2024. When it's all said and done, the Kirkwood class of 2024 is expected to exceed 1,600 graduates and will be comprised of students who have completed or will complete their program requirements following the fall 2023, spring 2024, and summer 2024 semesters. For those that put in the work and earned the right to graduate, the college held this year's commencement ceremony on Saturday, May 11th at the Alliant Energy Powerhouse in downtown Cedar Rapids. The venue was packed full of family, friends, and loved ones who were all on hand to recognize and celebrate this year's graduates as they walked across the stage and became alumni of Kirkwood Community College. This year, about 600 graduates took part in the ceremony. Those who attended heard remarks from various members of the Kirkwood community, including Board of Trustees Chair Jim Bullenauer, Kirkwood President Christy Fisher, Vice President of Academic Affairs Jennifer Bradley, Kirkwood Faculty Association President Julia Robbie, and student speaker Carson Brinks. After the ceremony, the party was on for the graduates and their loved ones, many of whom were seen celebrating their big achievement all over downtown Cedar Rapids that afternoon. The Kirkwood Athletics Department has been a powerhouse in the National Junior College Athletic Association for many years. But this year was something special and will go down as one of the most historic years ever for the Eagles. The softball team traveled to Spartanburg, South Carolina as the sixth seed in the NJCAA Division II Softball World Series. When the dust had settled, the Eagles finished as national runner-up behind champion St. John's River State. The second place finish was the best for Kirkwood in 40 years. Brennan Ross, Kaya Johnson, and Peyton Driscoll were named the all-tournament team, all of them freshmen. In addition, Peyton Johnson, Sailor Hall, and Rachel Schlotter all earned postseason national awards as well. The golf team entered the campaign as defending national champions and just missed pulling off back-to-back -back championship seasons. At the national tournament in Joplin, Missouri, the Eagles finished as the national runner-up to champion Mississippi Gulf Coast by only three strokes. However, the team did not go home empty-handed, as Grant Griesel won an individual national title, posting a 3-under par score over the course of the championship. He was just the second golfer in program history to do so. Griesel was also named a 2024 Jack Nicklaus Award winner, which is presented to the National Player of the Year for each NCAA division level, in addition to the NAIA and NJCAA levels as well. With the two national runner-up finishes, Kirkwood Athletics put a bow on one of the greatest seasons in college history. Of the six teams at Kirkwood, four teams ended their campaigns among the best in the nation. The volleyball team finished in the top 10 at the national tournament, women's basketball won the national championship, and the softball and golf teams each finished as national runner-up. What an incredible year! And not only will it be remembered as one of the best in Kirkwood history, it bodes well for the future of Kirkwood Athletics as well. This has been your Eagle Update for June 2024.